for this summer quest, you essentially have to pick up a no sweat sign. So this is like stage one. And we're going to go to this location right here on the sanctuary. You can go either to the sanctuary spot or the root lake spot. Both will work. So we're just going to go here and grab the, uh, the sign. So here we go. All right. You can expect a lot of people to be dropping with you and uh, ruining your day. So, you know, have a little patience. <laughs> Because, uh, you know, some people are just going to go for the gun and kill you. Because why not? So the sign should be right underneath us. Hopefully there's no weapon nearby. There we go. So this is the sign. Okay, so once we have the sign, we're going to take it over here. Oh, did I drop it? Yeah. Okay, so I cannot run with it. No insurance sign. <laughs> Yo, this is really funny, man. There it is. Alright, so, the Naruto guy is such a troll, man. He pretended to be a normal guy. He had a shotgun with him. Look at this, man. It's really pathetic. But yeah, that's the basic idea. As you can see, just uh, pick up the sign and then carry the no sweat sign and place it in a, at a sponsorship location, which was this location right here. So we picked the sign from here and we placed it here. And that's the basic idea. Just do that and that should complete the quest. For this summer quest, it says you have to complete a lap around the boat race circuit. So basically you want to go right here to this location. Make your way to this spot over here right next to the uh, sanctuary. And you're going to find this race here. Of course, it's not activated yet, but you can actually do the lap if you want to like prepare for the event or the quest. So as you can see, there's two uh, boats hanging out and you can just use one of them. And there is the timer right there. And those are the checkpoints, the little like arcs in the water. So those are the checkpoints that we're gonna go uh, that we're gonna go through. So here we are. All right, so let's grab this boat right here. Once you grab the boat, you need to wait. So let, let me jump into the boat. And you just need to wait until the timer hits zero. So as you can see, it's, uh, it's gonna have 15 seconds. If you go before the timer starts, it will not uh, count because the checkpoints will not light up. So we're gonna have to wait. So seven, six, five, three, uh, three <laughs> two one and now you can go so as you can see these are the checkpoints lit up so that's the blue light that comes and you can just you know look ahead until uh you see you see the next one that lights up and that's the one that you need to go to so basically we're gonna go and do uh, an entire lap around the this area and that's the basic quest basically it's not like uh, it's not that complicated i would uh, i would avoid these little ramps right here because it kind of like messes with the with the um, with the quest, I don't know why. All right, so this one is here. The next one should be the one to the right. Yep, there we go. It's a very simple quest. It's very peaceful. Of course, uh, it will not be peaceful once it is live, because everybody is gonna try to do this quest, and uh, you know everybody's gonna steal the boat. Everybody's gonna try to kill you while you're doing it. So it's not really uh, <laughs> the best thing to do. So here we are, and ha. I'm just gonna avoid this ramp because it could like send me on top of it which is very bad okay there's the next one right there so i need to take a whole u-turn and make sure when you uh, finish the last checkpoint you need to like go underneath this so it scores so for me it's one minute 13 seconds as you can see so that's my lap time so yeah basically make sure you make you make it to this point right here where i'm standing uh, and that will uh, complete the quest it's very simple for this summer quest, it says you have to make a character dance with a boogie bomb. So basically you just find these boogie bombs right here, which have been unbolted. So this is the boogie bomb right here. And this is an NPC character. So we're just going to grab that. And we're just going to make them dance. Just throw it toward the general direction. And they're going to dance. It's as simple as that. Of course, if you uh, find the boogie bomb in, uh, somewhere else, just go to the closest, um, the closest uh, NPC there. So if you want to know where the, all the NPCs are, I already made a video on it. Just write on my channel, all character locations. I think there's uh, how many? So just write all 31 character locations and you will find a full guide of all the character locations. So it doesn't matter where you find the boogie mom. Uh, just go to that video and you will find a character next to you and just go and make him, make him dance with the boogie bomb, just like I did right here. Let's use the other one just for good measure. And ha! And yeah, that's it. Let's do that and that should be the quest. For this summer quest, it says you have to uh, land after exiting the battle bus, so it's one of the easiest ones ever. So I just landed, I haven't done anything, I don't have any weapons, I'm just going to exit. And I should have the um, uh, the back bling. I forget what the name is, Ice Blasted Clanky something, Ice Blasted Crunchum, I think that's the name. There we go, we got the Ice Blasted Snow Crunchum. Very cool, dude. So yeah, that's uh, one of the first rewards, very cool.